Welcome back and today we're back with the Summit TX25 and I just got a new part in from Spare Parts Holland and this is going to be a hydraulic top link for my tractor. So let's go ahead and let's get into putting this thing on. So this hydraulic top link that I got from Spare Parts Holland, I found out about it through the Facebook Summit Tractor Owners Group. And a couple weeks ago, somebody posted on there that they had got a hydraulic top link for theirs. And they posted the link out to it, so the sizes were already in there. So I followed it out, and on Amazon, I'll put the link and stuff below, but through Amazon, it was $260 plus tax. So I went out onto their website, just to see if it was any cheaper. And sure enough, to get this through their website, with tax and shipping, it came to $225. So I saved myself probably $35 to $40. So if you're not too worried about just buying everything on Amazon, you can go through their website and get it and save a little bit of money. And I had it shipped the next day and it was here the next day. So I got it two days. So what comes with this is it comes with the two hoses that hook in to the hydraulic top link that comes with all the adapters already on there that you need. And then the last thing is just the nice big hydraulic top link. So let's go ahead and let's start putting these hoses on. Okay, so I got the hoses out and these are the sides that hook in to the remotes on the back and they're not tied on there or anything so you got to take them off and then I'll put a little thread tape on there and then we will tighten them right back on there Now it's time to install it since it's all put together and you can't put your three point all the way down when you're changing this out because you won't be able to get this long pull through top link bolt all the way out because of these arms right here it'll hit so let's take this pin out take this and it'll free up my three point piece right there do this one take out that long one now that that's out we'll go get the new hydraulic one and put it in and when putting the new one in make sure that the part that is welded on it goes onto your tractor and the part that extends out of the unit goes back towards your three-point quick attach or whatever you have in the back
Okay, now that we've got top link installed, it's time to hook it in, start up the tractor, and see if everything's working. So it looks like it's working, but as you can tell, it looks like this fitting is leaking a little bit. So I'll have to get some wrenches on it and tighten it up. But it is working. Thanks for watching this video. Hopefully that gives you a little bit of an idea of how to do the top link on this Summit tractor, but really any tractor you can add a hydraulic top link to. And remember, I'll put the links in the description down below, so if you want to Get this same one for the Summit Tractor, get it on Amazon, or go out and get it on their website. So thank you guys for watching. We'll see you guys later.